Nelson Mandela's former wife, Winnie, has spoken exclusively to ITV about the final moments of his life as she watched the anti-apartheid hero pass away. I sat there for three and a half hours watching that machine. But the first shock I got as I got in was uh, the fact that they had switched off the dialysis machine. I watched those figures going down and down so slowly. He drew his last breath and just rested. And at that moment, uh, Russia came in, um, followed by, I don't know, doctors also. She, she looked alarmed. And then, of course, uh, I, I was just brushing him. And so I moved from the right side where, where I had been standing. And I went around the bed to give her a chance. Um, he was gone. I consider myself very blessed to have been there when he drew his last breath. When that final hour came, the military in uniform and acting so officially, it only struck me then that he was leaving the house for good. Married to Mandela for 38 years and helping to lead his fight against apartheid whilst he was in prison, Winnie is often said to be the woman who knew him best.